So hey guys, still at Groove Rock. Um, I met Bill Stevenson yesterday. You wouldn't think I get starstruck again so quickly, but I'm here with local heroes, the prize death, because that's pretty fucking impressive. Um, hey guys, how are you guys? How are you guys? Okay, how are you guys doing? Don't, don't, don't. Just, just, we'll fuck this interview up. Okay, cool, let's go. How are you guys doing? We're doing fine, so we're yeah, yeah, really good. No. Yeah. <laughs> so um, really good. Yeah, like, um, start with the bombshell uh, you dropped on us this week. Um, the Mass Intruder direct hit USA yep. tour. How uh, fucking stoked are you? Really, really stoked. Like, yeah. what, we were supposed to do a, show, a tour with direct hit, and then all of a sudden, both of us got added to this Mass Intruder tour. It was like. <laughs> Belgium we have this sport um, where old people have pigeons in their backyard and then when they are strong enough they put them in, uh, in cages and a truck drives them to Barcelona they release all the pigeons at once and the first one to get back home is the old prize of you actually have a standard answer for that pretty much okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, yeah but like it's, it's a special thing you like to combine the English with the Dutch language like are you proud to be a Belgian and of your... Yeah. I think we should all be happy that we're Belgian or, or Dutch or uh, 
we have really? Western European pretty much, but Belgium has a really good uh, yeah. punk rock scene and it's, it's been great for us. When we started out it wasn't all that great, but uh, over the years it's, it's gotten really good. And uh, so yeah, we're really happy to beer. be a part of it. Yeah, we have, uh, we have cheap beer. Cheap beer. There's the uh, youth clubs. Uh, there's also always really cheap shows and, uh, and all bands get a lot of chances to play live. So in that, uh, in that few I think Belgium really rules. Yeah. And it's also always all ages, contrary to the States where there are plus 18 shows. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we have actually a nice scene here. Okay. Um, but correct me if I'm wrong, but do you, don't you guys have your own fest festival thing? Uh, we put on summer in October fest yeah. in, uh, in October, obviously. It's, it's very small, it's just a youth club. It's two days of really cool punk rock, hardcore, garage, whatever, and it sounds cool. Yeah, okay. And We've I've been doing that for five years. Yeah, I've went really there once, but I didn't know if you guys already know. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Are you, do you have uh, names already for this year's lineup? Or? Um, Aren't you working? Yes, yeah. we have some bands confirmed. Um, Sons of Buddha and uh, Not Scientists are confirmed. Uh, D Cracks and the King Ons from Japan. Ah, uh, that's cool. We have Flanders and then two digits, I think 84 or something from Brazil are playing. Uh, and Cheap Drags are confirmed as well. Ah, Cheap Drags. So we're working on some really cool bands uh, and I hope we can announce them in Brazil. Okay, cool. That will definitely going to be there again this year. Um, like, um, this is the cover for your new EP. <laughs> like, how the hell did you get this image for... Well, the, the girl who is selling our shirts right now, yeah. uh, Joel van Laar, she's really great. She, always, she also designs the Summer October posters, by the way. Oh, okay, cool. I don't know if you've seen the posters, but they're really, really cool every yeah. year. So that's, that's her work as well. And um, we're just like, that's the title. Um, just do whatever you want with it. <laughs> and this is what you said. Picture. Yeah, uh, <laughs> I guess okay. so. That's and uh, yeah, we're really happy with how it turned out. Uh, the rest of the artwork is all really cool as well. So. Ah, but it's not real. Jovanlaar.tumblr.com. Check it out. Ah, we're definitely going to do that. But this is not actually a real picture, then. It is a real picture. Yeah. The G. It must have been somewhere on Google. Did you kill it? Yeah. I have no idea. Let's hope. I'll ask you. Okay. Um, yeah, you use a lot of uh, cool sound fragments in your uh, releases, like your EP and your albums. Um, Office, I, I recognize uh, Office Space bit from Office Space, yeah. And uh, you have this Antwerp guys talking on the new EP. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, uh, why do you, I, why do you, how do you choose your sound fragments? Do you just go with the. It's pretty much just hanging in the studio and checking out YouTube all day while Mambo really? is inventing new solos and then we come up with all these things. <laughs> it's like, yeah, this should be on the record. Right? Yeah. Uh, that's cool. <laughs> but don't you ever have legal issues? Because I don't think Office Space is that old. Um, <laughs> I don't know if we should bring that. <laughs> oh, okay. We, we never played anything for for one of the samples, so. Oh, okay. We'll, we'll cut that from the interview. Then. That's okay. Um, oh, I'm, I'm at my last question already. Okay. Um, how drunk are you guys going to get tonight? Uh, way more drunk than I got yesterday. Definitely. Uh, uh, I only drank four or five beers the entire day because I wanted to get wanted to be fit for the show, the show tonight. But, yeah. Well. Not really. <laughs> our last, uh, not our last, the last time we went to Innsbruck for the Monster oh, Zero yeah. Mesh. We were invited there every year, so it's a really good festival. And, um, like this year we thought we had it all. Take it down. Thought through. And, uh, we got it all figured out, so we, we left the day earlier and we stayed at the camping site on the second day and stuff, so we were all gonna be really fit on the when we were there. So we arrived there really fit. And then we just started drinking on Friday and I got so, so drunk and I was super, super hangover all Saturday. I had to stay in bed and then we had to play at night. We were headliners of the Saturday at the festival. Oh, really? And I'd been puking and, and just sleeping all day, missing out on all the fun. So ever since then, I just we have big shows like this. Was I've that before or tried to be sober? Puke for breakfast. Uh, that's after. Oh, yeah, okay, 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 yeah. So it it's was really, related. yeah. It, made, it all made sense. Though. Okay, cool. Yeah, um, I read through my questions, so I want to thank you guys very much for the interview. And, uh, thank you, Michael. Good luck on your.